All right, so hello. Let's hope my stream is working better than last week. Am I right? Yeah, it's me, BMN82, back again. Not for anything too exciting. Uh, I have a game on my page I haven't played yet, known as Sable. So that's what we're going to be getting into. Hopefully it just launches correctly and everything is picking up properly and not lagging like last time. Hey, quick question. Is this game controller compatible? Full controller support. Great. So yeah, I don't know anything about this game other than apparently there's a desert. Which worked for me last time in Journey. The desert worked out. There's, there's nice music. Can I turn it down a little, though? What? Okay, I, I didn't expect singing. I don't know what to expect from this game, honestly. I expect it's going to be a multi-part stream. I don't expect to get this through this game in one day. But, I guess we'll have to figure it out. Like to start a new game? Yes. <clears throat> How's everyone's day been? I'll be honest, I tried to get the chat to work to show up like on stream. I couldn't figure out how to crop it. Or at least in Streamlabs, I couldn't. It was weird. I thought it'd be easy. Pop out the chat. Screen capture. Maybe it's just I need to look at something else. Ooh, this is nice art. Kind of looks a bit janky, but I mean, I I can appreciate the feel. Look at that sand. Interesting. Oh, and there's a bug. Am I the bug? Was this game a lie and I'm actually just the bug? Probably not. Well, there's... Okay, I think that's me. Is maybe a bit of backstory. I have no idea. But there are like dust particles everywhere. Okay, why is there just a giant face? Why does places that are like abandoned always have a giant face guarding them? Don't tell me I'm supposed to do something. You're not telling me to do something. Okay, I clicked A and it moved. So it's still in the cutscene. Why are you staring at this face? Oh, okay. L to move Sable. So that's my name, Sable. Cool. Why am I looking at the face? I can climb it? There's a stamina bar. This is Breath of the Wild. Okay. Um, sure. A to jump. Why did I come in here if just to run away from it? Oh well. This is... neat. I was expecting that to close after I got off it. Hold. Press A to jump. Thank you. Thank you, game. Ah, any secrets? Games love to add secrets and tutorials. We all know that. Move towards the wall to begin climbing. Keep an eye on your stamina. So this is just Breath of the Wild then, basically, right? Ooh, there's a ladder. I actually think I'm supposed to go up and I wasn't supposed to go down there. Press B to crouch. Oh, no, L, not B. There's a bird. Oh my, look at this. I like this art style for the game. I really do. Uh, yeah, I guess I guess jump down. There doesn't seem to be fall damage. Hup. Pa. Gosh, that's a lot of desert to cross, though. You really walked all this way? Perfect, don't even bend your knees. 
hold B to sprint while moving. You can only sprint while you have stamina. Smart. Okay. Okay, truthfully, the desert wasn't that far away. Ibex camp. What? This must be where I grew up? Maybe? Oh, okay. That was a weird camera angle. And there's a campfire. Oh. I, I'm enjoying this so far. I didn't know if I would. That person has a robot leg. They're immediately cool. I can feel Jaddy smiling behind her mask. I think Jaddy's the other person. Just as I know, she can feel the teeth bearing little grimace behind mine. Nervous, and she's softly, sweetly amused. In her eyes, I probably have very little to worry about. You know you have nothing to worry about, don't you, Sable? Uh, I think I have a lot to worry about. You don't seem trustworthy. And yet, here we are. Shrug, but in any attempts to act casual and fruitless, movement is jerky. I don't even think I've ever been more aware of my little shoulders, she laughs. I mean it. I mean it. But I do know who you are. You're going to be nervous until you've started, and then you'll act like you've been doing it your whole life. Remember the first time you rode a bike? You wouldn't even let me put you on the seat. You were so afraid. Hands were always little claws gripping into me. Feel the memory in my fingers. But then I promised you it was going to be alright. I told you how much I loved riding my bike as a young woman and how wonderful the wind felt through from fabric. Suddenly, there you were. You sat down, you leaned forward, pulled the little grasping claws on the handles, and you were off. Is this a story game? Like, I mean, I know story. I just don't want to read the entire time. I remember thinking, just watching you tear over the sand. Look at her. She can do whatever she wants. Reaches out and places a hand on the edge of my mask. I really don't think she is currently. And you can, Sable. You take a breath. I take a breath. I think I'm ready. Let's do it. I thank Jaddy for telling and tell her with a nod that I think I'm ready. I know you are, so let's get you started. Need to talk to Halal and Driss. Driss should already have made arrangements for your bike, and Halal will ha will share something. Well, let's just say useful as it is fun. Think I might suspect what Jaddy's stay saying, but I stay quiet. Okay. After that, I suppose we'll see you off. I'll I'll be back soon. Sable, don't go planning your return before you've even left. Take all the time you need. It's a big decision you're making out there. I tell her that's why I'm so eager to make it, to choose well and quickly, that I don't go too far down the wrong path. Whatever you decide, you do so with my blessing. So don't try using me as an excuse to come home early, eh? She knows me. She does. Now go speak with Halal. I'll be there to see you off. Speak to Driss as well. I've told him to arrange your bike with Cizo. But you know how he is. I have something to give you. Compass will help you on your journey. Same I used on my gliding. An ar artifact. Not artifact. Artifact. It's weird. You might say. Take the device in my palm. Fist naturally there. Perfectly weighted and crafted. Each component slides together with incredible, satisfying precision. Thank you. Oh, that's that's a neat way to do like a map thing instead of just in like one of the corners. Just have it on you. Let's climb to the top of the rock. So what did I have to go there to get like quote unquote initiated and then I had to be here? I don't know. I want to know who's at the top of that. B to sprint. Up the stairs we go. And then we'll actually truly just test the fall damage scenario. Gosh, this is tall. I thought for sure I'd be there by now. It's like going up infinite. 
All right, there we go. I'm right at the top. Who's up here? Hello there, person. Caesar looks busy. I should leave her to it. Wow. Okay. Cool. Fun. Ah, oh, sweet. I got 20 whatever that is. Neat. Alright. Time to test fall damage theory. Oh! Sweet. No fall damage. Just a little bit of stun. Ah, uh, let's see. Someone's down here. Yep, right there. He's probably going to go send, get me to get resources to fix it. Though I've told myself not to be too eager, it's all I can do not to race up to Driss. Driss is camp manager. It's been difficult to get a hold of lately. But now I strongly suspect that he's been working on my bike in secret. Perhaps it's extra beautiful, or has some custom feature. No, it's going to be a basic bike. What will his name be, I wonder? How fast will it go? Will my legs feel sore, or will I get used to it? Driss turns with a bit of a start. Sable! Uh, uh, d d hello! I was told you have something special for me. Uh, she sent me to speak with you. Did she? Uh, what about? Told him about something special and make a leading gesture, slowly trying to perfectly, trying to be perfectly cool and con confidential. But I can't do it. I'm too keen to the word spell out. I asked Driss if he might have portable, possibly maybe have a bike for me. Your bike! He yells like it's an idea he just had. Your bike! Yes, of course. Right. Yes, your bike. That was meant to, to that I prepared prefer you because today is your gliding yes dress nods along with me yes of course right yes yes I do have that I like this guy my blood runs cold has he forgotten by which I mean I arranged it for you in a well sort of a tutorial for you you're gonna make me go through another tutorial. Yes, exactly. A learning experience. You mean you forgot. You see, Sable, before one can own their own bike, they must prove that they can ride a bike by taking a test ride on a different bike. Wow. I think about it and find I've never heard of part of the gliding, but Driss does seem earnest, sort of. So instead of worrying about your bike, I'd like you to try this bike as a test. Gestures to the sand cutter at his side. It's quite old and a little shabby. Oh gosh, camera, please. A tester if I've ever seen one. I'll give it a go. Really? I mean, yes, good. Be gentle, though. The sand cutter is older than Jaddy. You treat her with respect. Now I ride the bike through the ring and back. And here's some advice to you, my young glider. Don't fall off. Perfect. Oh god, what? Okay. Okay. Uh, okay, so it's RT Accelerate. I really thought I was just going to immediately fall off. But oh, this is nice. That, that is weird. Woohoo! So if I want to strafe, go left and right. Oh gosh. Uh, I hold A, which immediately stops me, and then I go like this. What is that over there? That's neat. And now, of course, he's not here. Oh no, he is here. I return to Driss, who somehow manages to seem caught off guard despite knowing I was coming. Sable, congratulations! How was your first pre glide ride? Any strange rattles, unexplained hissing, small fires? What do you mean, fires? Surely you'd notice if you were on fire. I would hope so. I really would hope, even a little bit. Was that a possibility? Well, obviously it didn't happen, so I think we're fine. Driss, is this bike dangerous? Well, he doesn't finish. Have we already been by Halal? Am I not getting a bike? 
Well, you're getting used... Well, you're getting the use of this sand cutter. That's something, eh? You can borrow it to run your little errands. My little errands. And I oh, have got something to show you, too. Help you out with more of a... Er, mobility you are after. With my confidence in this exercise, only lightly tarnished. I thank Driss very much, and I depart. So what if I do fall off? Let's just try ramming this thing, eh? Okay. I'm trying to fall off here. It's a lot harder to fall off than I thought. Who are you? What's in here? That's what I'm more concerned about. Oh. I mean, I'll take loot. Red dye? Oh, perfect. Dye for a bike. By the looks of it. Let's find those stairs again and go find out where I actually need to go. I like how they give me a bike and I'm immediately like, yes, ride it through town. Don't mind me. Oh, you're the person with the robot leg. You're cool. As I approach Halal, they give me an enthus They give an enthusiastic wave. I've already s always appreciated Halal's swerve and vigor. On a day like this, I'm ready to match it. With a touch of nerves for balance. Sable, take this. It was a gliding stone. Hands me a stall, round stone, nestles into my palm, feel warmth not burrowed from Halal's hands, emanating from within, run my thumb over it, and find it softly electric. Like static on cloth. Thank you. I thank them for the fuzzy rock. Oh, Sable, you don't know what this is, do you? No, I do not. What if just giving you is a gliding stone? What do you feel? I feel warmth. fuzziness. Then you're doing it right. What you feel in that stone is openness. Look at the stone. It seems quite closed. Gliding stones are vessels for the perpetual. They suck up his power like little sponges and hold it there for you to channel. Right now it's empty or dormant and waiting for you to fill it up. I ask how I can do this. Take it to the temple ruins at the edge of the canyon. You'll be able to activate it there. I'll clap their hands twice and bobs a little. Appreciate a good mood at time like this. Come back once it's done. I want to hear all about it. Okay. Thank you. I'm just going to go out to the side of your house if you don't mind. Let's go. I'm so glad I don't have to run this. Okay, good. It is this way. I was making sure. Apparently it's more this way, though. But there's a boat here. What happened to this place? I have no idea, but I'd love to find out. Oh, come on. There we go. Thought I might not make it for a second. Oh, well, I couldn't make that, so that's a thing. I saw through the map there for a second. That's never a good sign. This thing doesn't have, like, gas, does it? Whoa, okay. Also, I like how you can see the sun moving. Maybe not sun, but, like, 
you can see the shadows of things moving. It's, it's nice. This is a nice, relaxing game so far. I'll be honest, I did come in here wanting to stream Slime Ranger 2, and I might still. Not today, a different day. But it's also, Slime Ranger is kind of like my game. My solo game. So I'm probably just going to play that by myself. Okay, it's up there. Let's get my bike up there, shall we? Okay, that didn't work out so well. Bike, go! Ah, darn it, I have to get off here, though. It wants me to climb. Activate the gliding stones at the altar. Will do. Haha, -ha, here we go. Altar of Mothman, by the looks of it. Birds. Sucks? Is that you? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I was not expecting the floor to give way on me. Well, looks like I'm here now. I wonder if they didn't want me to bring my bike in here. Alright. Gotta go to the altar. Oh. Creepy. Again, the art style is really nice. It has its own feel. I like it. The stone thrums like the beat of a herd as I approach the altar. Am I afraid? Exhilarated? Or maybe it feels right. It feels right. I am ready for Rohana to know me. I am ready to know myself. I feel her curiosity in this sacred place. I know I am in her sight. I pull out that stone. Oh, that stone is no longer black like I thought it was. Ow, that thing literally threw itself out of my hand. Like, come on. Whoa, color. Whoa. This place was like black and gray, gray and white, whatever. Now it has color. I gotta say, I like it. Oh my gosh, it captured me. This is the end. Or maybe it's giving me color. It's hard to say what happened there. I truly have no idea, so. Man, imagine having to walk there. That would have sucked. Oh, and now I'm going up. Good thing my leg was hanging off and is just going to get cut off. Not actually, but that would have been... That would have been sad. Maybe hilarious, but sad. Alright, I got the stone in my hand now by the looks of it. Yeah. I nearly died. Also, why do we wear bass? I can glide? Oh, that's... Actually, I like that. Press A and hold to glide midair. How long can I glide for? I assume not too long, but I assume long enough. Why would they add gliding if there wasn't fall damage? Oh, let's get there. That's going to be an easy spot to climb. Alright. So if I can glide from here to the wall... Am I supposed to climb that? Oh, maybe I'm supposed to climb this. To get up higher. Higher. 
Oh, come on, you can do it. Come on, Sable. Oh, barely. Oh, there's a chest. It's gonna give me 20 of that stuff, whatever that stuff is. And then ladders, you don't need the stamina, which is great. Alrighty. Now if I jump from here, I should be lucky enough to glide all the way down to the doorway. Nah, almost the doorway. My bike is this way. This is nice. I like being able to glide like this. But I also like being able to fall and take damage. Brum brum. That thing literally prevented me from falling off. All right. Yeah, actually, there was. Oh my gosh, this would way would have been so much easier. Why didn't I just take this way to begin with? Why did I take the long way? Oh uh, well, live and learn. Am I right? Live and learn. That's right, and I gotta go back up to him. Ibex camp. Yep, I know. Where is this? There it is. Should be right there. Let's just drive on into his house again. Hey, buddy, I'm back. <laughs> Woo, okay. So, when I return to Halal, it's clear. They know what I've just experienced. They're excited on my behalf in a way that makes me miss them before I've even left. Isn't it incredible? How does it feel? Exciting. True freedom. Safe. Like a warm hug. You feel, almost feel embraced by the perpetual warm and safety in your own little bubble, I swoon. Oh, that's such a nice way of describing it. Law's mood doesn't seem to darken, but they sigh. They let it hold some bit of sorrow. Very lucky, you know. I miss it so much, that feeling just floating on the breeze. But I suppose it's best that it fades with age, hmm? Or else I might not have come back from my gliding. I'd just be up there heaving myself into chasms. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, I'll, I'll throw myself in for you. That's what I like to hear. I know pe people manage to keep it up, but I don't know that I've got the time to practice as much as they do. It takes really serious focus. Laughs, even if there's a bit of regret in it. And I certainly haven't got that. Still, I suppose gliding would mean much if it were... All gains and no loss, huh? Think about that and decide there is already too much loss on my mind to consider it further. I am saying goodbye to my clan, my family, my homely. My homely? My home, my childhood. To you, lose the perpetual is a sacrifice for another time. You're going to love it up there, out there, Sable, even when you don't. My advice? Try to have fun. There's a lot to be said about my ritual and independence and all that out there, but... There was an easier place if you put joy first. I thank Halal for their advice and for their help. Tell them I'll miss them. I'll miss your leg. Honestly, I'll miss your leg. Be over before you know it. Warning and reassurance, all in one. Say goodbye to Halal. Before I go, Halal su suggests towards the tower. It seems Caesar wishes to see me before I leave the clan. I was already up there. Well, now I can take my bike up there. They're going to love that. Right through the fire. Woo! This is going to be weird to drive up there. But I can do it. Oh! Okay. Can't do it. Well, I mean, I can. I just held accelerate for too long, I'll be honest. This thing can actually get up some speed if I let it. No, we're not falling off again. I'm making it up there with my bike.
Why would they let me do this? <laughs> Hello there. Cizo and is an outclanner to the Ibexi, but I've known her for nearly as long as I can recall. I like your mask. You look better than the others. And I think of her more as kind of a distant relation than any sort of outsider. Machinists, I'm told, are given their posts, and by their training, then their code. Must go to where they are needed. But Cizo has been among us so long that it's easy to forget and assign assignment first and foremost. As far as any of us are concerned, she is one of us. I think there is a perception among the other clans that the Ibexi are quite insular. That our designation of Ibexi versus Outclaner suggests some nervous othering of those who are unlike us. But in practice, such things are more the result of our nomadic nature. We seek to know who will travel with us, and we must leave behind, but all are welcome to join. And I'm always pleased that Caesar did. Sable, how do you do, clan child? I can only think of one thing. A bit worried, am I really getting a bike? Cizo has a throaty quality in her voice, and it rumbles through her mask when she laughs. She's a quite serious person most days, always torn between pride and alarm when I managed to make her chuckle. Yes, Jaddy told me how excited you were. Cizo sniffs. She almost. She also told me Driss would have been coming along to get your bike together, but I think he may have. I knew it. What? I hadn't meant to say that out loud, so I tell her I was just clearing my throat. Ha! <laughs> could cover up. I don't begrudge Gris for his forgetfulness. Where I tasked was... Camera? C c camera? Thank you. Where I tasked with so many odds and ends, I might just be as scattered, and besides, this will be good for you. I want you to scavenge the hum hover by parts yourself. Going to make my own? Sounds like an adventure. Sounds like an adventure. Caesar sounds like a little adventure before my big one. It's more meaningful than you know. To bond with one's bike before it has taken form is more prolific than labor. Here, take this. The navigator. This is the navigator. You can use mark waypoints on your compass. Should be useful in finding the old parts. Ask Eva where I might start looking. Bikes are reborn in the ruined ships. Fragments spread apart. Good start would be a ship down there near the camp. Find another one up on that great rock near the other side of the canyon. And another behind the old dam. Use your navigation marker down if you need. You'll need to gather control panel, power supply, and calibrator. Okay. Be back soon. Dare they will create something new out of the old. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is neat. Press RB to use the navigator to mark interesting landmarks to appear. Uh, shoot, I didn't actually finish reading that. <laughs> Place marker. And then he said there was one way over there. And then behind the dam. Perfect. And now we take my bike, turn it around, and go straight off. Perfect. This thing really won't let me crash. We're gonna go to the dam first. Seems more interesting than the others. He said behind the dam. So that's where I'm gonna go, is behind it. Hopefully think stream is working well compared to last time I streamed. Minecraft took up a lot of processing power or something from my stream, and it sucked. Darn, I have to get off. Also, my nose is itchy. Ah! Still itchy. Why? Ah! Oh, okay. Pressing A, mid climb. Let's go. Good to know. Bird. Ah, so this is probably going to be the control panel. 
Or, you know, I can just open up the entire dam or something. Okay, then. Um... Uh, perfect. Oh, I think it's gonna be in there. I probably gotta get that thing right there into that spot. Right? Yeah, that's what I'm assuming. I like this music. That was just playing. X. X. Put it in. Powers. It opens the door. Man, why didn't anyone do that sooner? And just leave it open for me. Maybe the game's trying to teach me something. Also, it seems like only certain things can be climbed, which is a good thing to a degree. An atomic control panel? Sweet. What else is in here? Nothing? That doesn't surprise me. Really seems like a game or place with only one purpose. To have the one thing I need and then I leave and never come back. Seems like there might be something over there, honestly. However, I don't know if I... Am I willing to walk? No, I want my bike. Also, the sprinting really isn't any faster than walking. Like, it is, but it isn't. Also, seems I can't regain stamina on climbing, which is a neat feature. Next, we're going to go for the one on the other side of town. Nope, I changed my mind immediately. We're going for the farther one. Let's go! I like this, but this thing is so slow. I want to... Okay, hit a rock. Hit another rock. I want to zoom through the sands. Like that and do cool jumps and tricks. Like, it's still decent, but I want something faster. I want speed. I want to at least go 20 kilometers an hour. Tunnel. Secret tunnel. Do I gotta do a lot of climbing puzzle here or something? Yep, I gotta get up there. Fun. All right. Climb the rock like your life depends on it, because honestly, it does. There we go. Ooh, look. Already inside. Perfect. Oh, let me guess. Yep, this is how I was supposed to get up here to begin with. I just took a different route. Perfect. I almost missed that jump, and that would have sucked. Oh, that sucks even more. I fell. I didn't glide all the way up. Come on, you can do it. Okay, good. Stamina recover. Do that. Do that. Go up. Up, up, up. Then up this way. Up this way. Does it take stamina to jump? Doesn't seem like it, but it doesn't recharge very well.
Alrighty. Where to next? I wish the camera turned a little bit faster, I'll be honest. Birds! Ah, well, this looks like the thing I need. Or at least, like, part of it to be powered. Something. Oh, no, that's just the power supply. Cool. I'll just take that. That's great. Now, what is this thing? I want to know if I can power it. Just fall. Aha, there's a chest. I knew there'd be something. Cuts. A cache of a hundred cuts made from metal. Perfect. Glide, 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 and fall. Wait, wait, that, I don't think that was supposed to happen. That was nice. Aw, I wanted that rock to give me more. Yeah, that marker there. I'll remove it. That marker, keep the marker over here. I guess there isn't one. Nope. Let's go. Probably after I finish building it is uh, when I'll call it quits. I got a lot of stuff planned for tomorrow and I need all the sleep I can get. I'm going to rec room for friend's birthday. Gotta get up, get money for a friend because I owe him gas money for driving me to work. Have my Mandarin. It's gonna be great. Foreign market. There's a lot of stuff happening tomorrow. And it's gonna entirely mess up my sleep schedule for work. Sweet, this is what I need. Nope, that just opens the door. Again, wish the camera could turn a little bit faster. Nothing to be found in the ship, but I notice a blinking light flashing at a dashboard cockpit. Push it. Voice crackles from me machinery in front of me. It sounds like recording, barely audible. Stop messing about with those buttons, you absolute dumbo. <laughs> Sorry, ramen. Concentrate. I don't think I have to remind you how much work it was to get this far. We're almost here. Let's see what the old machinist told us holds up. If not, there'll be hell to pay. Hear the sounds of mechanic adjustments, three clicks, buttons being pressed maybe. Okay, when I push the orange thing, pull that lever hard. Yes, Ramen. Sound and click before a snapping sound. Oh no, not Rohana's mask. Not that hard. You've torn it out. Suddenly the speakers fill with static, low lumble that gradually increases in pitch, then the sound of someone cheering. It worked! We're flying! More cheering. Is that the sound of someone dancing? Okay, well let's focus. This thing is moving fast. Need to slow it down a bit. How do we do that? Let me check the notes. And you can't. Ramen? The lever, Toma. The one you just ripped out. We're going too fast. We are going to crash. We need to try to... Cuts off. Weird. Leave it alone. Uh, isn't this where they said I needed to go? An atomic calibrator. What? Okay, cutscene. There's a kid. Saima, are you looking for a calibrator? Immediately on guard. Saima has always been a mischief maker and taken tremendous pleasure in tormenting me. In theory, 
I am older, more experienced, and should be able to withstand it. In practice, you won't find it here. I've hidden it. You'll never find it. Never, never. Never fails to get to me. You're a horrible child. Last off my irritation, but I'm not going to give her the satisfaction. Cross my arms, try to effect a change. I'll give you the calibrator. Put up my hand, proud of myself for standing tall before Saima. If you give me some beetles. That's fair trade, it's something you want for something I want. Try to tie a more picture to push her over to the cover or to add quiz. Then I simply stifle and take her little hand. Perhaps some adults and know where I can find some. Gosh darn it. I was supposed to be done. Come run. Come run you over. You're making me do more work than needs. All right, let's go. I gotta find a adult to talk to, but which adult? I'm an adult. Why can't I talk to myself? Yeah, that's right. She was the one that was right here. All right, who am I talking to? Is it you? No, it's not you. Someone up there. There was a little thing here. I'll take that. I'm technically stealing from my own people. Oh well. Don't make me go up there again. No, it's you. No, nope, it's not you. Nowhere I can find some beetles. Just east. Can't watch up and catch it though. Seeds growing in the rocks around the nest. Drop a seed. Beetle will start eating. Then you can sneak up and grab it. I don't need to hear what you have to say. There's my bike. There's my bike. East. Let's go. I don't understand. Is it up there? It probably is, but how do I get up there? Also, this is a dead end. Can't get there with my bike. I can't just climb up. I don't have enough climb. Maybe there's a hill? Or, you know, something anything instead of just gaping cliff face uh, okay it's so over here man it would be nice if they told you a little bit more on where you're trying to go okay weird but whatever Let's go. Get some beetles. Socks, I know you're here. Stop spying on me. can't just walk up and catch one, can I? Hey. Oh, they dig. Interesting. Gotta let them start eating it first. 
got your nose. Hey. You. Oh, I can throw it? That's interesting. Okay, catching beetles is nice. It's fun. Oh, come on. Alright, thank you guys. I'm leaving you now. Gotta go get my bike stuff. Let's go. She likes to play in the cave. I already know that. I've already been to the cave. I got a different color for my bike down there. Ibex camp. Yep, I know. I know. Come on, let's go. I just drive through this guy's farm. He, he, he won't mind, right? If he minded, he would say something. Embarrassingly vindicated as a hand sign by the beetles. Rather than gloat, she must cloud and begins to cry. What have I done? You're leaving, you're leaving, and you'll never come back. Comforter, yeah. Blows her nose, wipe her hands on a tunic. Yara never came back after the last gliding. Aren't you sad? You were her friend. She might visit again someday. Will likely visit. Will I ever choose to if I decide to do another clan? How will you find us? We have moved a million times by then. Offer, I will always find the Ibex, no matter what. Please don't go. Not to worry. Sooner, and I'm sure she posed behind the mask. And I add that I am not back sooner. She knows that she will be ready for her gliding by then, and she can come bother me herself. Promise? I say yes. Good. I suppose I can come see you off. I thank her and say goodbye for now. Good. Cizo, Cizo, you're the one up there, really? You're gonna make me get back up there? I don't want to ride the bike back up there, but I don't want to run up there either. So I'm riding the bike up there. Let's go. Ride the bike all the way up. All the way up, all the way back. Alright. I'm back. Why'd you bring the bike up? Because I can. Fair enough. Turn to Caesar with the parts and she weighs me over. Sees feel a pang of sadness in my chest. When will I see her again once I'm gone? Well done, Sable. Well, yes, this is everything we need. Ready to assemble a bike of your own? Yes. Let's assemble it. <sighs> oh boy. Relaxes. Only true appreciates when it's in development. Wonder if it's the way for all machinists, machinists, whatever. Understand, Sable, that not is that the components you acquired, they fit together, not by chance, by effort, they belong to her. They have always belonged to her. Who? All we're doing is assembling her, oh, they mean the bike, from what she has already been. Nod and feel soft buzzing in my ears. Among my clan, we believe that machinists have names held for ages like deep secrets unheard by those unequipped to listen. We will find this one's name together. Assemble the machine. Ah, yes. This is gonna go there. The bike wings. Got it. And now we're gonna take this. We're gonna put
put it in there. And then we're gonna take this last part, put it in the back. Perfect, and now it looks like I can press my button. Press the button. Simon, I put the bike together. Yay. I hope this thing goes fast. Speak to you. Hey, listen. Tells her whole leading closer. Simon. All at once, I know the hoverbike's name. Simon, I say it in a whisper to let Cizo know. Simon, Simon. Well done, Sable. Does she want to go with me? She does, Clang Child. Simon has a wandering spirit, like you, I think. Tells Simon that I am eager to know her better, and Sizu looks quite proudly at the both of us. You are ready then for the gliding. May all the gods turn their faces from you, Sable. Odd blessing, perhaps, but Sizu is prone to one such thing. She can read her tone. It was meant to be quite sweetly. You must learn to listen to Simoon, to care for her. Seek out fellow machinists on your travel, Sable. They will teach you the f art of machine whispering. I got a badge. And the badge. Pranny of my ilk on your glidings. Show them and they'll be worthy to give you more badges. Thanks, Caesar. Twice. Give a bow. I am ready. Give me my bike. Give me my bike. Turn it. Darn it, I left my bike up there not knowing I'd come down here. Maybe if I come back here like at the beginning of the game, it'll still be there. What is this? Open the garbage can. Logging in. Hello, Sable. No mess. Okay, thank you. That's a mailbox. Hello there, you blind... Actually, I like your mask. Never mind. Sable, that cartographer landed his balloon while you were away. You should speak to him if you see if you could get a map. Not and begin to go. Jaddy's testing back. Here's something. 200 cash. Good to know the value of money, but you never want to be ruled by it. Thank you, and head out. Ah, uh, yes, that balloon guy. Woo. Climb up the rock to go find him. Yes, that's how it works. Totally. Couldn't have landed any closer. That's a child. I'm only interested in you, though. Are you just full robot? Approach the cartographer. Ah, greetings, child. Saw you looking longingly at my great balloon. Quite a piece of work, ain't she? Uh, longingly? I was looking curiously in that the balloons aren't exactly my ideal vessel. Newcomer shrugs. Fair enough. Suppose one kind of cons itself in a little peaceful bubble that float down from the sky. Balloon loses some of its charms, but I'll accept your curiosity. Get the balloon a proving nod so that it doesn't feel too bad. Weird. Oh, well, good to meet you, and oh, I should have introduced myself. I'm Jordan. Tom Sable. It's probably the map you're off for, eh? Yes, I'm after a mapper. Mapper? Yeah, I'd like a map. I'd love a map. Of course you do. That'll be 50 cuts. I'll buy it. Confirm. Thank you, Jordan. Good luck. News cartography for me, but I spent a little extra time out there just to enjoy the world. Speaking of, I'll keep an eye on the skies. Plenty of colleagues out there will have plenty more maps to sell from Hawk the Sloatic Waste. Farewell. Thank you. Fast travel. Perfect. Your hoverbike will also travel with you. Good. So how long does this thing hold up? 
Like, if I'm falling indefinitely, can I just float indefinitely? Who whistled at me? Has to be you, right? Weird. Not a badge. Yes. Give a bow, thanks. Well, keep this up, you'll be headed for the Melkast Mass Caster. Possibly far away, imagine choosing what I want to be. I ain't choosing what I want to be forever. You got plenty of badges. You're fine. Gosh, this is a lot of reading. I didn't expect to be reading this much in this game. How will I choose one? You'll know now. It's time, is it? Time to walk through the face door at the Temple of Rahana. There, you'll assemble your gliding mass and go. Perfect, let's go. Before you leave... Oh, sweet. No longer be disabled. Clan child of Baxi. Simple be disabled. Rest will come. You will always love me. Thank you. Those in my inventory? Clothing. I don't like this mask. However... The new clothes, I like them. Yep, gotta run all the way up these stairs again. Boop, 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 do, 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 do. Stairs, 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 stairs. Everyone loves running upstairs. So much so. So, so much. Hey look, my bike is up here just as I thought. So I'm going there. Let's go through the smoke. Upon the river bend or whatever, I don't know. Now I gotta climb up this thing again. Was here at the beginning of the game, now I have to go back. Of course I do. Why wouldn't I? They love to make people back travel. I want my new mask. This mask looks silly. Also, I noticed there's less color in these places. Also... Oh wait, is that how it's supposed to be, maybe? No, it's supposed to be a cape. It has just glitched uh, to go through the front of me. Let's write that open the door. Like, look at this. Whoa, okay. And there's another face behind it. <gasps> Faceception. What is this? Is that a gun? That's a guy with an arrow, not a gun. My bad. Uh, so what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to get up there? It's a little bit hard. They don't give you much direction. I should head to the temple to begin my gliding. Cool. Let's just get as high as we can. That's usually a good idea in games. As high as you can. That's where I came in. That's a chest. Gosh darn it, why is there a chest there? I want the chest, but I'm not going back for it. Mothman, what's up? Do I gotta get to the face? Do I, oh, I think I gotta get over there. Huh. All right, well, I think I can get there from here. Yeah, yeah, I got that. I got it. Climb, Sable, climb. 
I think I gotta get onto that platform. Ooh, I put a helmet on her. Don't you dare tell me I had to choose, like, red or blue. Because I chose red at that point then. Uh, yeah, there's another one right here. This one's the... Oh, no, they're both red. Cool, that's exciting. Doesn't make them feel like there's any choice. I just had to get both. You can do it, Sable. I actually thought it just made me fall because of that. I was like, no. You wouldn't. But no, I honestly, I could see it doing it. See, I could jump, or I could just walk around like a responsible adult. Oh yeah, I can't make it from there. I would have had to go that way to get there. Oh well, I don't need it. Imagine missing that jump. I mean, granted, it's not. I'm not going to say it was easy. But... Oh, I gotta get the other side now too. Great. Cool, what is, that is this side now. Fun, 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 fun. At least it's not the hardest. It's just time consuming. Let's land on that pillar. Perfect. Stamina recover. Go. Didn't realize there was three. You know? So I came up here the first time and I was like, oh, okay, I'll just go over there. Meanwhile, this is where I was actually supposed to go. That feels like everything. And I'm in a cutscene, so it definitely feels like everything. Interesting. I don't like that. Nope. Ooh, look at that mask, though. Why is all the color going around it? You're supposed to go onto the mask. I'm trying to decide if I'm red or yellow, then? Am I yellow? Is that what it means? Is it no color? I'm red by the looks of it from these things. Oh, there it is. I got the mask. Weird. Okay. Cool, I like this mask better. I will say that. It looks better. Alright, I got my mask. Let's go. Got my mask, I got my backwards facing cloak. I'm going up the outway. Wow, it still teaches me how to crouch to do that. I'm sorry, they took my speeder. How dare they? 
Granted, I have a new one coming, so. Yeah, capes are always a weird thing to get in games. Because they never like to work. I feel like I have superpowers now, and honestly, that's what I'm here for. Oh no, no one's here. Also, that is jaggedy walking. That walking could have been done better. They've already left? You telling me that's what happened? Logging in. Hello, Sable. Well, Sable, this is it. By the time you hear this, we will have been gone. Why would you leave? It's a journey you must begin alone. Nuisance. Lost in transmission. That ungrateful. Too much to hear from the cracks in her voice. Not to run weebly into her arms and stay forever. But I am ready, so I close my eyes and listen. But though you go by yourself, you are not without friends, not without family. I'm literally alone. You are not without love. Okay, that I'm with, but I'm literally alone here. Things you always carry with us and do your mask. And no, I'm supposed to. I'm not supposed to do this, but if I fire you, I might go see Utari. Their machinist at Burnt Oak Station. Excuse me, and among Caesar's closest friends. They're a good contact. Another badge, only a suggestion. As for us, I'll send another message once we return to Ewer. Keep an eye on post boxes, try not to forget us. The world is waiting, Sable. Good luck. Darn, they left! They left me! They better have at least left me my bike. Also, like, I wanted to show them my mask. Am I trying to run after them? Is that what's happening? Or is that ring where they put my bike? Okay, you're walking on your own. What? Whoa. Oh, this thing feels so slow. All right, first things first. Drive through this, and we're good. Okay, actually, this thing isn't bad. I like this. Woohoo! All right, we got our bike. Save. Yes, I would like to save, please, game. It is almost 2 a.m. So with that being said, uh, that that will be it. Short stream. I'll definitely play more of this. That seemed fun. I am now going to go to bed. Yes, I'd like to exit the application, please. Thank you. Uh, so yes, that'll be the end of stream. Shorter stream today. I won't be on tomorrow. I'm going to spend tomorrow with myself, friends, whatnot. So for now, I hope you all have a wonderful day, evening, night, whatever it is for you. Uh, and yeah, until next time. I don't know.